let's make some cracked chicken in the Instant Pot because we don't have time to wait all day. I've got almost six pounds of chicken and the use by date is tomorrow, so I need to cook it up. I'm probably gonna use half for my cracked chicken and then I'm going to use half and make stuffed chicken breasts because that just sounds yummy. In my Instant Pot, I've added one cup of water, onion, uh, minced onion, minced garlic, um, some chicken better than bouillon soup base, and a couple teaspoons of some red chili pepper flakes because I want it a little spicy. I've added four chicken breasts. Now I'm gonna put the lid on and put it on high pressure for 10 minutes to let it cook. My chicken is done, so now I'm just gonna take this hand mixer and I'm gonna shred it up. Be very careful with this process because there's hot liquid. Now I'm gonna add 12 ounces of cream cheese to my shredded chicken mixture and some Hidden Valley Ranch seasoning. How much ranch? Until you feel like stop, stopping and dumping it in because I just buy it in bulk. Now we're gonna continue mixing this all up. This mixer makes it so easy to make this. It's not hard at all. I tasted it, it needed a little bit more ranch, so I put some ranch in there, and now I'm gonna add in some shredded mozzarella cheese. I've added in my cheese and my black pepper, and I'm just gonna use a spoon to, to stir it in because I don't want the beaters to get all stringy with cheese. Lots of pepper. I like pepper, though, and this is a pretty big batch. So we're just gonna stir this cheese in until it all melts up nice. This is great with peppers, with crackers, to eat as is. It's keto friendly, it is freaking delicious. Let's try some. I've got my cracker. Let me move over here. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Yum. You can take this, you can sprinkle some cheese on top of it in a baking dish, melt it, and serve it as a hot dip at a party. It's great. You can put bacon in it. You can do so many variations with it. Mine is just cooling off on the counter. You can see how much I got. It's a lot. Honestly, I don't know what I was thinking, but don't ever buy six pounds of chicken at once.